It's time for class. Please lie down on your back. President Shavasan. Legs apart and the arms apart. Move the awareness from toes to the head and relax each part of the body. Relaxing the feet. Relax the legs. Relax the back, the abdomen and the chest. Relax the arms, the shoulders. Relax the neck the head and the face. Let go in the mind. Slow down the thoughts by connecting with the breath. Make your breath very slow, long and deep. Inhalation, abdomen expands, chest expands, whole body expands. Exhalation, allow the body to sink down, abdomen contracting in. And the next breath, join the legs together, interlock your fingers, stretch your arms over the head, give a good stretch to the body. Release the stretch, bend the knees, turn over and sit up for the prayer. Close your eyes, sit up straight. Gajananam, Bhutagnadi Sevitam, Kapit Jambo, Palasara Bakshikam, Umasutam, Jokavinaji Karanam, Namami Vigne, Shurabadi Pankajam, Shurananam, Bunkumarak the Varnam, Mahamatim, the Femayura Bahanam, Rudra Sisunam, Sursaninatam, Buham Sadaham, Sharanam, Prapate, Yakundain to the Shar Haradura. Ya Shubra Vastra Vita, Ya Vina Vardanta Maditikara, Ya Shweta Padmasana, Ya Brahma Juti Shankara Prabhiti Be, Deva Isada Pujita, Samam Padu Saraswati Bhagwati, Nishi Shijadya Paha, Om Namashivaya Guru Ve, Satitananda Murtai, Nishprapanchaya Shantaya, Shri Shivananda Te Namaha, Shri Vishnu Devananda Arate Namaha Om Sarva Mangala Mangale Shive Sarvartha Sadike Sharanye Trembake Gauri Narayani Namostute Narayani Namostute Om Shanti 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 Om Namaskar, let's get ready for the class. Kapalabhati practice. Keep the back straight, hands on the knees in chin mudra. 
Inhale deeply. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. The first round of Kapalabhati. Inhale deeply. And begin. One, two, 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 one, Inhale, exhale, get ready for the retention, breath retention, inhale, a comfortable deep breath, hold the breath gently. Slowly, with control, exhale, inhale, exhale. The next round of Kapalabhati, on the count one, forcefully pulling the abdomen in to exhale the breath. On the count two, just relax the abdomen and the inhalation takes place. Sit up with your back straight. Inhale deeply and begin. One two, 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 exhale. Inhale. 
Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Prepare for the retention. Check your back. Keep the back straight. Lift up from the lower back, middle back, upper back, and then relax the shoulders down. Chin parallel to the mat. Inhale. A comfortable breath. Gently hold the breath. Awareness at the third eye center or the heart center. With control, slowly exhale. Inhale and exhale. Adjust your body if you have to. We begin with the alternate nostril breathing. A comfortable sitting position. Right hand in Vishnu Mudra. <coughs> Left hand in Chin Mudra. Through both the nostrils, take a deep breath. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now block the right nostril with your right thumb. Alternate nostril breathing. Through the left, inhale. On one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath. Close the nostrils. Right, exhale. <clears throat> One, um, two, um, three, um, four, um, five, um, six, um, seven, um, eight. Inhale, right, um, one, um, two, um, three, um, four. Gently hold, close the nostrils. To the left, exhale. Um, one, um, two, um, three, um, four, um, five, um, six, um, seven, um, eight. Inhale, left. Um, one, um, two, um, three, um, four. Repeat the breath. Close the nostrils. Right exhale on um, one, on um, two, on um, three, on um, four, on um, five, on um, six, on um, seven, on um, eight. Inhale right on um, one, on um, two, on um, three, on um, four. Hold. Close the nostrils. Awareness third eye center or the heart center. The back straight, shoulders roll back. Through the left exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four, hold. Right exhale, um, one, um, two, um, three, um, four, um, five, um, six, um, seven, um, eight. Inhale, right, um, one, um, two, um, three, um, four. The breath, it's a gentle breath attention. Relax all the muscles. Do not tense anywhere in the body. Exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale left on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold.
Say it right to one, or two, or three, or four, or five, or six, or seven, or eight. Inhale, or one, or two, or three, or four. Retain gently, close the nostrils. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath gently. Right exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right on one, on two, on three, on four, retain. Relax the body. Let go in the mind. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale on one, on two, on three, on four, retain. The right exhale of one and two and three and four and five six and seven and eight. Inhale on one and two and three and four. Retain the last breath retention. Left exhale on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Bring the hand down. Relax the body. Stay here. Breathe. Now keeping the eyes closed, please stretch your legs and lie down. Relax in Chavasan. Keep the awareness in breath. Relax. Take a deep inhalation, bring your legs together, interlock your fingers and stretch your arms with the head, give a nice stretch to the body, stretch the whole body. Release the stretch, bend the knees to the chest and stretch your arms in line with the shoulders, palms facing down. Inhale, as you exhale, lower the knees to the right and turn the head to the left. Inhale back to the center. Exhale, knees to the left and head to the right. Keep the knees together and the feet together. Shoulders down. Inhale, come up. Exhale, lower the knees right and turn the head left. <coughs> Sorry. Inhale, come back up. Exhale, knees to the left and head to the right. Inhale up one more time. Exhale, knees right and head left. Inhale up, exhale, knees left and head right. Inhale up, now hold the back of the thighs and rub the body forward and backward a couple of times, then you stand up. Get ready for Surya Namaskar. Feet together, inhale. As you exhale, join the palms to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up, 
and arch your back, look up to the hands. Exhale, stretch the body forward and reach down. Align the toes and the fingers. Inhale, the right leg back. Stretch your chin up. Hold the breath, the left leg back, body in a straight line. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V, tuck the toes, lift your buttocks, look to the toes. Inhale, the right leg forward, right foot between the hands, left leg back and look up. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up, arch back, look up to the hands and exhale, release. Inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back, plank pose. Exhale, knees just on the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward. Exhale, the right leg forward. Inhale, stretch up, arch back and look up. Exhale, release. Next round, inhale and exhale, join the palms to the chest. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the right leg forward. Exhale, the left leg forward. Stretch up, inhale, arch back. Push the buttocks forward, look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Inhale and exhale, palms together, chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back, plank. Exhale, knees chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. <clears throat> Inhale, the left leg forward. Exhale, the right. Stretch up, inhale, arch back. And exhale, release. Next round. Inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back. Stretch it a little more away. Hold the posture and breathe. Now take a breath and move into the plank pose. Tuck the abdomen in, align the wrist and the shoulders and look down at a point between the hands or just a little ahead of your hands. Keep breathing. Slowly as you exhale, bring the knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, slide into the cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Hold the posture, breathe. Push the heels and the hands down. Tuck the abdomen and push the chest down. Keep looking to the toes or look to the navel. As you inhale, bring your right leg forward. Right foot between the hands and left leg more back. Look up. Center the hip. Don't let the body lean to the left side. And on the exhalation, move your left leg forward. Stand the forward bend. Shift the body weight forward. Keeping the chest close to the thighs. And without lifting the hands, if possible, straighten one knee and the other knee. As you inhale, stretch your arms forward and reach up. Push the buttocks forward. Look up to the hands, head in line with, between the arms. Push the buttocks more forward and exhale, release. At normal pace, the left side, inhale. 
and exhale, palms to the chest. Inhale, stretch your arms, sit and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward. Exhale, the right. Stretch up. Inhale, arch back, look up. Exhale, release. Next round. Inhale and exhale, palms to the chest. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back. Hold the breath, left leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the right leg forward. Exhale, the left leg forward. Stretch up. Inhale, large back. Exhale, release. Inhale and exhale, palms to the chest. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back all the way, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back down. Exhaling, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward. Exhale, the right. Stretch up. Inhale, arch back. Exhale, release. Next round. Inhale and exhale, palms to the chest. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted three. Inhale, the right leg forward. Exhale, the left. Stretch up. Inhale, arch back. Exhale, release. Inhale and exhale, palms to the chest. Inhale, arms up, arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath right. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the left leg forward. Exhale, the right. Stretch up. Inhale, arch back. Exhale, release. Please sit down and lie down. Relax on your back in Shavasana. Turn the head side to side. Slow down the breath. Round toes to the head. Watch your body. Scan the body, let go of the tension, and just relax. slowly bring your legs together interlock your fingers and stretch your arms over the head give a good stretch to the body release the stretch 
Now we get ready for the single leg raises. Fix the arms by the side of the body, palms down, legs together, toes pointing up, chin to the chest. Inhale, stretch the right leg straight up. Push the heel out, exhale, bring the right leg down. Left leg up, inhale. Exhale down. Right leg up, inhale. Exhale down. Left leg up, inhale. Exhale down. Right leg, inhale up. Hold the right thigh with both your hands and bring the leg closer towards the body. As you exhale, raise the head and chest, come up, pop the hands up. Still the body for some time. Hold where you can relax the body, where you can breathe properly. Slow down the breath. And as you become more comfortable in the posture, try to pull the leg closer towards the head without bending the knee. Just keep the elbow soft so that the neck can relax, shoulders can relax. Now we'll move the right leg to the right. So adjust your hands. If you can hold the big toe with your right hand, please do that and put the head down. Everybody put the head down. And if you're not able to hold the toe without bending the knee, hold the inside of the right thigh with your right hand and lower the right leg down to the right side. So as you bring the right leg down, you notice the left buttock lifts up. So try to push the left buttock down so that you work better on the hip joint. Do it with full awareness. Breathe. Head can be in the center or turn to the left. Slowly, as you inhale, come back up with your leg, release the toe hold and hold the left, uh, sorry, right toe with your left hand. Stretch the right arm in line with the shoulder. On the exhalation, bring the right leg to the left side. Keep the knee straight. If the knee bends, please hold the outside of the right thigh with your left hand. Head is turned to the right, press the right shoulder down and breathe. Keep the right knee straight. Breathe into the abdomen. Feel a good twist in the body. Slowly inhale, raise the leg up, arms by the side of the body and bring the legs down. Sorry, right leg down. Take the left leg up, inhale, hold the back of the left leg from the, uh, the with both your hands, pull the leg closer. And as you exhale, raise the head and chest, come up. Hands more up if possible. Keep the toes pulled in, heels pushed out. Chin stretching up towards the left toes. Relax the face, neck, head and the shoulders. And push the right thigh more down. Close your eyes and breathe. Try to move the leg a little more in. Now to release the left leg to the left side, if you like, you can hold the toe with your left hand. On the Put the head down on the exhalation, bring the left leg to the left side, adjust your head position, right arm stretching in line with the shoulder. Keep pushing the right buttock more and more down. As you inhale, raise the left leg and change your hands position. On the exhalation, bring the left leg to the right side. Keep the left knee straight, left shoulder down, and breathe into the abdomen. Slowly, as you inhale, raise the left leg up. Arms by the side of the body. On the exhalation, bring the leg down. 
Now adjust your hands position for the double leg raises, either under the body or by the side of the body or tuck the hands behind the head. Inhale, raise the legs all the way up with your knees straight and heels pushed out. Exhale, bring the legs down. Inhale up. We'll do it six times. Exhale down. Third time, inhale up. Exhale down. Four up, inhale. Exhale down. Five up, inhale. Exhale down. Six up, inhale. And with control, exhale. Bring the legs all the way down. Relax in Shavasan. Turn the head side to side. Slowly bring your legs together, interlock your fingers and stretch your arms up. Give a good stretch to the body. Place the stretch, bend the knees, turn over, sit up into the child's pose. Let's get ready for the headstand. Shishasan. Sit up on the heels. Let's get ready for the Shishasan. Hold the opposite elbows. Place the forearms close to the knees and stretch your arms forward. Now interlock your fingers loosely. Lifting the buttocks, place the top of the head down, back of the head against the hands. Tuck the toes in, straighten the knees up and walk forward. Take a breath or two. First adjust your back straight and then you bend the knees into the chest. Move the knees up. Go up with control and straighten the legs up. Excellent. Hold the posture and breathe. Just a few more breaths. Mm -hmm. Slowly bend the knees, bring the knees to the chest. Let's release the posture and bring the feet down. Child's pose, Shishankasana. Please sit up and lie down in Shavasana. Turn the head side to side and relax.
Mm, bring the legs together. Interlock your fingers and stretch your arms up. Nice stretch to the body. Release the stretch. Fix the arms by the side of the body. Preparing for the shoulder stance, Sarvangasana. Legs together. Move the shoulders down. Bring the chin close to the chest. Inhale. Raise the legs and the trunk. Support your back into shoulder stance. Now adjust your body. Bend the knees to the forehead. You would like to interlock your fingers. Stretch your arms on the mat. Bring the shoulder blades together. Tailbone lifted up. And then when you're ready, support your back and straighten the legs. Shift the body weight to the shoulders. Push the buttocks towards the head. And watch your legs from toes to the buttocks. Relax the legs. Let go. Watch your facial muscles. Relax the face. Working on the thyroid gland. So feel that pressure in the throat region as you straighten the back. Move the hands towards the middle or the upper back. Better pressure on the throat. Lengthen up the body as you inhale. And on the exhalation, move the right leg over the head. Inhale the right leg up. Exhale the left leg down. Inhale the left leg up. Exhale the right leg down. Inhale up. Exhale the left leg down. Inhale up. Prepare for halasan on the exhalation. Bring down the both your legs with control. Once the toes are down on the floor, please release the arms down. You can interlock the fingers and pull the arms away from the body, from the head. Tailbone should be lifted up. Knees away from the forehead. Keep breathing. Now support your back and separate the legs apart. Hold the toes with both your hands. Right toes with your right hand, left toes with your left hand. Breathe. Preparing for Karnak Beard Asana. Now bend the knees by the side of the ears. Get your hands from over the thighs to hold the ears. Drop the top of the feet down. Relax the feet. And stay, breathe. Keep the knees uh, pushing down. Excellent. Relax the toes behind, away from the body. Slowly release the posture. Hold the toes. And now support your back. Bring the legs together. Place the arms down and raise the legs slightly above the mat. Use your arms as breaks and come out of the posture. Perfect. Bring the legs down. Now turn the head side to side. And bend the knees. Hold your ankles for Setu Bandhasan, the bridge pose. As you inhale, lift your buttocks up, come up. Thighs parallel to the mat. 
chest close to the chin. Feel the nice arch in the spinal column. Keep breathing. It works to strengthen the knees, the spinal column, working on the thyroid and the parathyroid glands. And slowly exhale, come down. Chakrasan, hands under the shoulders, fingers turned in. As you inhale, raise the buttocks, press the hands and come up. Hold it for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Come down. Hug the knees to the chest. Rotate, place the hands on the knees and rotate the knees clockwise and anti-clockwise three to four times. Then get ready for the fish pose matsyas. Place the legs down and bring the arms under the body. Elbows nicely in, shoulder blades together, hands stretching under the thighs. Legs together. As you inhale, raise the head and chest, come up high. Exhale, arch your back, lifting the chest up, bring the top of the head down. Perfect. Keep pushing down on the elbows and lengthen the breath. Long inhalations, pause for a while. Longer exhalations, pause for a while to make one slow, long, deep breath. Hold it. Mm. As you inhale, raise the head and chest, come up, look to the toes and exhale, bring the body down, head down. Release the arms, rotate the wrist, clockwise and anti-clockwise, turn the head side to side. Shavasan, arms apart, legs apart. Feel the lightness in the mind, lightness in the body. Just relax. Slowly bring your legs together, take a deep inhalation, lock the fingers, stretch your arms up, stretch the body, stretch and release the stretch. Bend the knees, turn to one side and please sit up. Join the soles together for the butterfly, sit up straight and move the knees. Now stretch your legs forward. You can uh, sit facing the window. Yeah. Bend the right knee and hold the right leg up in your arms. We'll do the rocking baby. Good. Hook the right foot in the left elbow and right down around the right knee. Move the leg side to side. Rock it. Now stop rocking the leg. Just move the leg more up into the upper chest. And still the body. Feel a better stretch in the hip joint as you move the leg up and into the chest. Preparing for the Akarna Dhanurasana. So hold the right big toe with your right hand. 
push the right knee away from the body towards the wall behind and hold the left leg, left foot with your left hand. Keep trying to pull the right foot towards the right ear by pushing the right knee away. Hold it and breathe. Slowly release the posture. Put the right leg down and bend the left leg up in your arms. Rock the left leg side to side. Keep the back straight as much as possible, lifting from the lower back. And now move the leg up into the upper chest and still for some time. Mentally visualize a Akhandatanudasan on the left. Hold the left big toe with your left hand. Push the left knee away from the body. Pull the left foot more up, holding the right toes with your right hand. Hold it, breathe. And slowly release the posture. Now prepare for the Pashimatanasan, sitting power with bend. Legs stretched in front, toes pulled in, heels pushed out, knees pressing down. Lengthen the back. Inhale, raise the arms up along the ears. Lengthen up. As you exhale from the lower back, please stretch forward and reach down. Settle down after three to four breaths, adjusting the body initially and then just letting go. Breathe into the abdomen. With the exhalation, contract the abdomen. Allow the body to come down more. Keep pushing the knees down. As you inhale, stretch forward and stretch up. Let's release the posture. Exhale, bring the arms down. Come to stretch to the body. Hands behind the body. Lower the head back. Lift your buttocks and come up. Toes pointing down. Hold it and breathe. Last five counts. One, two, three, four, five. Slowly come down. Relax on your abdomen. Make a pillow with your hands, preparing for the backward bends. Turn the head to the right, big toes touching, heels apart. Watch your breath. Make it long and deep, recharging the body. If the shoulders are tense, you can move the hands according to your comfort. Get ready for Bhujangasana. Place the forehead down. Toes pointing back, feet together. Hands into the shoulders, elbows pointing up. As you inhale, raise the head and chest, come up. Hold the posture and breathe. And slowly exhale, come down. Turn the head left and relax. Get ready for Dhanurasan. Put it down, bend the knees and hold your right toes. As you inhale, raise the knees and the thighs, head and the chest, come up.
feel a good pressure on the abdomen. Try to lift up higher on the abdomen. Thighs more up, come up. Keep breathing. Holding your five. Come up higher. Four. Three. Two. And one. Slowly release the posture. Hands under the shoulders. Come up on the knees and the hands for Marjorie Asana. Inhale. Push the hip back, arch the back, and stretch the chin forward. Exhale, round the back, tuck the chin and abdomen in. One more time, inhale, stretch. And exhale, round the back. Come back to the neutral position. And please now tuck the toes in and lift your knees up. Let's move to the downward job, inverted V pose. No, please come up. Come up into the inverted V, mountain pose. Good. Now we're preparing for the preparatory pose for Ekpat Rajkupotasan. So uh, take the right leg up in here. And as you exhale, bend the right knee close to the chest or the forehead. And then move the right knee towards the, sorry, right foot towards the left side. Good. Put the left knee, uh, knee down. And put the forehead down, stretch your arms forward. Just as we do in every class, most of the classes, do it. Now, those who are comfortable, try to pull the right foot up towards the front of the mat to make the right leg parallel to the mat. You get a better stretch in the hip joint. But your focus is on the hip joint. Center the pelvis. So, Deshna, bring the right knee towards the right. This is not a correct posture. Right knee towards the right. Yeah, and then square the pelvis, center the pelvis. Don't let the body weight shift to the right hip. Slowly come up, put the hands near the hip and bring the right foot close to the groin, right foot in towards the body. And arch your back, drop the head back, arch back as much as possible. Slowly release the posture, moving back to the inverted V. Take the left leg up, inhale. Exhale, bend the left knee towards the chest and open the left foot to the right side. Move down with the right knee down. Stretch your arms forward, center the body, and come down. You can move the left foot more up as and when you are comfortable. Hold the posture, feel a good stretch in the hip joint. Slowly come up. Draw the hands near the hip and move the left foot towards the body. Arch your back, lower the head back, hold the posture and breathe. Create a nice arch in the back. Please move the foot in. And slowly release the posture, moving back to the down inverted V pose. Now bend the knees and relax into the child's pose. Arms by the side of the body, arms facing up. Sashankasana. Please sit up. Let's do the half spinal twist, Ardhmasindrasan. Sit to the right side of your body and bring the left foot across the right thigh. Both the sitting bones down, place the left hand behind. Strike your right arm, inhale, lengthen up the body. As you exhale, twist to the left. Push the knee with your upper right arm to hold the ankle and look to the left shoulder. 
Close your eyes and breathe. Pressure helps stimulate the abdominal organs. So as you do the right side, you're stimulating one side. And we are oh, giving a nice twist to the spine, working on the vertebral column, twisting both sides. We are work, uh, working to bring a lot of blood to the vertebral column. Trying to hold equal time for both sides. Usher helps lose fat from the hips, thighs, and the abdomen. Makes the spine more useful, more flexible. As you inhale, raise the right arm and exhale, bring it down, change the side. Sitting to the left side of your body, bring the right foot across the left thigh. Place the right hand behind. Left arm, inhale up, lengthen up. As you exhale, twist, lean forward, hold the ankle or hug the knee. You can just do what you are comfortable with. Look to the right shoulder. And when you hold the posture, try to get the shoulders in one straight line. Chest parallel to the wall that you're facing now. So twist more from the lower back, then the middle back, upper back, then the head turns in that order. It's a very strong posture. If you do it properly, you get multiple benefits in the body. As you inhale, raise the left arm and exhale, bring it down. Hug the knees into the chest. Sit up straight. As you inhale, stretch your chin up. The stretch takes place from the lower back and then reaches up towards the upper back. Exhale, bring the chin down to the chest. Inhale, back to the center. Exhale, turn the head gently, right? And gently to the left as you exhale. Inhale back to the center. Exhale, lower the head down towards the right side, shoulder. Feel a good stretch in the left side. Keep pushing the left shoulder down. Inhale, come back up. And exhale to the other side. Slowly come up. Inhale. Release the posture. Let's move up into the crow balancing posture. Get into the squatting position. Rest your knees on the upper arms and get a good grip of the knees and the hands and the arms. Look at a point in front. Transfer the body weight forward towards the hands until the feet lift up. Try it again. Slowly release the posture and please stand up. Face the camera and separate the legs three feet apart. Now turn the right foot to the right. We do the Parshottanasana and turn the upper body also to the right. Stretch the arms, inhale up, lengthen up. As you exhale, stretch the body forward and down, come down on the right leg. If you are unable to place the hands down by the side of the foot, you can hold the leg and do the forward bend on the right leg, Vashrutanasana. Keep the knees straight, body relaxed, feel a nice stretch in the hamstring. Now keep the hands on the floor, on the mat and turn the right foot in, take the left leg out. We'll do the forward bend on the left leg, Parshottanasana. Move the hands towards the left foot. If you've come up, you can stretch up and then come down. Adjust your body. 
where the body can relax, where you can breathe and feel a nice stretch in the hamstring. Slowly come up and release the posture. Now, so, uh, turn the toes slightly in. We'll do the Prasarita Padottanasana. Toes, panjong ko under laye thoda sa. Interlock the fingers behind. Interlock the hands, piche. Get the shoulder blades together, elbows straight. And on the exhalation, toes should be turned slightly in the pigeon toes. As you exhale, stretch forward and come down. Keep moving the arms up in order to bring the body more down. Arms from over the head, trying to reach towards the floor in front. Keep going. Don't restrict the body. Let the arms, shoulders relax. Let the head drop down towards the mat. Don't tense the neck. The back should be vertical. And don't separate the legs too, too wide because it makes the posture easier and you work lesser on the body. And now put the hands down between the feet and try to bring the top of the head down. So your feet, your hands, your head should be in one straight line. Hatu ko zameen pati ka hai, pairon ke beech mein. Pairon ke beech mein laiye, hatu ko. Take your time, slowly raise the head, release the head from the floor and bring the toes in. Feet in, legs together, dangle the arms loose and one vertebra at a time, please come up. Now we prepare for the triangle trikonasan. Separate the legs three and a half to four feet. Turn the right foot to the right and left foot in. Keep facing forward, stretch the left arm, inhale up, lengthen up. As you exhale, bend down to the right side. Maintain a good stretch in the left side of your body, so do not twist the hip. Push the right budget more forward. Look in front or look up. Keep breathing. Inhale, slowly come up. Exhale, bring the arm down and change the side. Turn the left foot out and the right foot in. Hip facing forward. Inhale, stretch your right arm up. As you exhale, bend down to the left side. Stay here and breathe. Inhale, slowly come up. Exhale, bring the arm down. Now join the legs together. Come to the front of the mat. Lie down on your mat. Relax in Shavasan. Final relaxation. Slow down the breath. Let's do the tensing of the body parts. Lift both your legs two inches above the mat. Tense the legs, tense the legs and drop. Squeeze the buttocks off the mat. Tense the buttocks, tense, tense and drop. Press the lower back to the mat. Press it down, release. Lift your chest up, up, up and drop it down. Squeeze the shoulders to the ears. Push the shoulders down. Raise the arms two inches. Clench your fingers tight, tight. Tight, open the fingers and tense your arms, tense and drop. Tense the facial muscles to the nose, tighten the face, let go. Open your mouth, stretch your tongue, open the eyes wide, look to the forehead and stretch the face, stretch. Release, let go, close the mouth. 
Shoulders move down, turn the head gently. Do the right and do the left. Take your time. Back to the center. Final adjustment to the body. Legs comfortably apart, feet relaxed to the sides. Shoulders move down. And then you bring the arms six to eight inches away from the body, chin close to the chest. Make this adjustment and then just let go in the body from wrist to the head. For the next five minutes, we'll still the body completely, we'll still the breath, and we'll still the mind. Focus on the instruction for mental relaxation of the body parts. Relax the toes, the soles, the heels and the ankles. Relax the knees, the thighs, and the buttocks. Relax the abdomen and the chest. Awareness on your back. Relax the lower back. The middle back, the upper back. Relax the shoulder blades, spiral coil. Just let go. Touch the legs in the back. Do not tense any part. Let gravity pull the body down. Focus on the arms. Relax the fingers, the palms, the wrists. Relax the forearms. Elbows, the upper arms. Relax the shoulders, the neck and the throat. Relax the chin, the jaw, the mouth, the ears. Relax the cheekbones, the nostrils, the eyes, the forehead. Relax the top of the head, back of the head. Completely letting go of the body from the toes to the head. Feel the lightness. Let the body sink down with gravity. Do not resist gravity. Relaxing all the abdominal organs. Relax the lungs. Relax the heart. Relax the brain. Visualize a good relaxation to all the organs, to all the body systems. Let go in the mind. Relax the mind. Say to yourself, my mind, my body, my breath are relaxed and working in harmony. I am relaxed.
Slowly bring the awareness back to the body. Move your toes, move your fingers. Turn the head side to side. Bring the legs together. Take a deep conscious breath. Stretch the arms over the head and give a good stretch to the body, final stretch to the body. Release the stretch. Bend the knees, turn to one side. Take your time and sit up. My laptop is creating some problems. Kindly bear with me. We'll end the class with the final prayer. Masitomasatamaya. <laughs> Tamasoma Jyoti Gamaya, Breathe your ma, Breathe Angamaya. Om Purnamada Purnamidam Purnat Purnamudachate Purnasya Purnamadaya Purnameva Vashishyate Om Shanti 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 Thanks to the masters. Ayam Tatsa. Thank you. Bye. Thank you, Smita. Thank you. Thank you so much, ma'am. Good morning, ma'am. Just give me a second. Recording is not stopping. Just a minute. Just a minute. Thank you, Smita. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much, everybody. Thank you so much, everybody. Thank you, Sudeshna. Thank you, Smita. Thank you, Sudeshna. Thank you, Smita. So I need to turn off so my I need to turn off start. my no. start. Say bye bye now. Say bye bye now.